Well, the Birmingham boys have earned themselves quite the reputation recently. They're also known as no blah, blah, start again. They're also known now as the Gowrie males by some of the other lodges. Before the Birminghams and before the Matimba males, there was a very famous coalition of male lions called the Mapohos. Leslie, yes, this was absolutely part of the original Mapoho territory. An amazing thing about the Mapoho male lions, it was a coalition of six members strong when they first started to take over an area. And they actually ended up getting hold of a territory that I think was about a third of the size of the Sabi sand itself. So their territory stretched all the way from around Buffles Hook to Torchwood to Cheetah Plains, our entire Traverse area, Central Juma, Arethusa, right down to Mala Mala, Londolozi. Their, their territory was absolutely enormous. And that in the end was the interesting thing about the way in which the Mapojos went, because they left behind, as male lions do, a trail of destruction in terms of the number of lions that they killed. It's what male lions do when they have a takeover. But I think what was extraordinary about the Mapojos is because there were six of them, they, it, 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 their impact was felt over such an enormous area. And it actually left in a way, once the Mapojos were eventually, they had to split. They had to split in order to maintain the territory and they did They split into four into two. The famous Mr. T or Satan as he was known along with Kinky Tail on the one end and the other four on the other. And they, it, they left behind a, a very interesting impact in terms of a vacuum of ma young male lions because once they were slowly but surely uh, they got reached the end of their, of their tenure and they were killed off one by one either by Salati males, by the Majingulani males, the other male coalitions, which is inevitable. They had killed so many cubs, they also created their own, they obviously produced their own cubs as well, but a lot, they left behind quite an interesting vacuum of dominant males just because they took such a, a huge amount of area. Ah, so Birmingham boy number two is a lot more enthusiastic than the Inkuhuma lioness. As an interesting aside, Birmingham boy number two is also a little bit less skilled than the other Birmingham males. He hasn't quite got this right just yet, which is why the process is taking longer than normal and why he hasn't gone about biting her neck yet. down.